and that is at Wall Street New. What even our distinguished and respected Orlama did not know. Wall Street knew that this entire international monetary system was fraudulent, bottle. Ignorant of it. That's the price we pay when we only have scholarship but no nur. And the oil that they got from Saudi Arabia was free of charge. You didn't have to pay for it. Did you hear that? Huh? Did you hear that? It was free. After the collapse of the Bretton Woods Agreement, the world of paper money is now 100% haram. Money, which is losing value, is by the definition of the Quran haram. But we were asleep. Let me conclude myself in it so nobody will be angry with me. We were all asleep. And we didn't recognize that we were being taken for a ride. In fact, it was more than something haram, it was riba. But the Prophet had said, Sallallahu Ta'ala Alaihi Wasallam, about the riba which would come with Dajjal. What did he say? He said that it will be as difficult to recognize it as it would be to recognize a black ant on a black stone on a dark night. I mean, you don't need a PhD from the University of New South Wales to recognize. The only man who can see that ant that my loss was somebody else's gain. Let me repeat that. When my money could no longer buy a camel, it could only buy a donkey. The value of my labor has been diminished by half. My loss was somebody else's gain. Diminished to one week. If this keeps on going on, I'm going to be enslaved. A new slavery will come upon the world if this keeps on going on like this. Riddle with violence. And our sisters, or oh, let's put it, my sister and my daughter and my mother must now sell her body for one dollar. It's very cheap now, one dollar. Yeah, it's happening while those fellows are fighting over popcorn. Surely it was time for the Ummah of Muhammad to stop fighting amongst themselves over popcorn. Because that's what they're doing. Fighting over popcorn. While this massive betrayal of Islam is taking place. And we are blissfully ignorant of it.